Hello and welcome to a Scratch tutorial. Today I will be showing you how to record your projects on Scratch. This idea was suggested by Gooby, so thanks to him for this idea. So you want to go to scratchaddons.com, then press install for Chrome here. And it should redirect you to the Google Chrome store. Just wait for it to load. And then click Add to Chrome. It should, should yeah. So then press Add Extension. It, it loads there. Then you should be redirected to this welcome site. So you can just click that off and go to Scratch. Wait for it to load. And then you want to press this little jigsaw piece thing here called extensions. And you'll sh and you should see and you should see scratch add-ons here. You want to click the pin so it turns blue. And it should appear right about there. So press create. Wait for it to load. Uh. Now you want to click on the scratch add on slow will go here. Then you want to click on the add-ons tab and just search up record and this should come up and then just toggle the switch so it turns orange there. And now you want to reload the page. Now you should have a start recording button here but before that let's just make something quick. Once you've done that, you'll want to press start recording and um, you'll, you want to change this record duration um, depending on how long your project was. So if my project was around 50 seconds, I could just put 60 seconds there and it can. And you can check what these boxes if it can include project sounds and bloody bloody blah 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 And anyway, once you've um done what you want and and once you've done this, you'll want to press start and it will say waiting here and as soon as you click the ground it will keep on recording until I press the stop button. So if I just press stop right now um then um it should come up to save the file um, i don't know if you can see this but um it's prompting for to, for me to sh to save the file so if i just um so if i um, make a new folder i'll just call that so if i make a new folder and i call that um screen test Go on there and then save it. And now if we go to files it, and we go to my scratch folder, videos, screen test and you should be able to see my video right here. If I try and open this, we'll see if it if the Scratch Project has recorded. As you can see, it worked. 
So if you enjoyed this tutorial, please like and subscribe. That will be really good. Thank you and credit to Gooby for for the idea of this tutorial and goodbye. <sighs>